For many of you, you've just created your first blog. And for most of you, this may be your first personal blog about reading. So congratulations are in order. I'm so excited for you. <laughs> we blog in English 102 because it's a style of writing that many of you will use in your professional careers and personal life. It also gives us the opportunity to become more comfortable troubleshooting social media, writing concisely with visual aids, and practicing little r research, as it's sometimes called, or research where you find a few trustworthy sources to help you make an informed point and a less formal piece. You should have also started up your theme essays, Rough Draft, which will follow an academic style of writing and use MLA formatting and citation. If you have any questions about how to format your essay, use MLA citation to cite your poem, story, essay, or play in your discussion or on your Works Cited page. Please ask this week as you finish your paper. There are also example papers in the student work gallery, which could be helpful to review. Next week, we'll be reading and discussing additional pieces of literature in Discussion 3, and you'll want to finish the draft of your theme essay, so you may share it with your peer review partners for the following week. If you have questions about finding your peer review group in the forum page, it's linked to the assignment page in the lessons, please message me. Your partners are counting on you, so make sure you're aware of the deadlines and get your own paper and feedback for your partners posted on time. Even if it's not your most amazing work, <laughs> giving them something will help them increase their own editorial skills and it might provide you with insights to help you get to the point where you're really proud of the work that you're producing. I am excited to um, see what you decide to write about for your theme essay, and I hope that you enjoy a wonderful week. I will see you soon.